In a top three ranked matchup, LSU knew it wouldn't be easy to remain the only undefeated team in the country. So the Tigers set a president early, scoring five runs in the first inning, ultimately leading the team to victory. The offense looks strong with RBIs from Raylene Gutierrez and Allie Newland. But Kelly Lynch's base clearing double is what helped fire up the Tigers. Yeah, I think for sure that set the tone. You know, I think they came out big. And then our offensive staff just had such a great plan that was well executed by our team. As the number three ranked team in the country, Texas was not going to go down without a fight. The Longhorns cut the lead in half in the third inning. Just me understanding that like some of those weren't my best stuff uh, and knowing that like I can beat them with my best stuff as long as I stay in the game in my head, or stay centered with my head in the game. Um, Keep the strong confidence going. Even with an 11 a.m. start, LSU's faithful came to the game to support the number two ranked Tigers until the very end. That was awesome. Uh, shout out to Tiger fans for that because 11 o'clock on a Tuesday, that was, that was very energetic, very fun, very live, and I think it really helped us. LSU's offense scored one run in the last four innings, but pitcher Sidney Burzon helped the team defensively finish in the game with four strikeouts. Well, we won with her idea. I mean, at the end of it, we won with her game plan for the last three innings. Um, kind of threw the book out, and we did what we're not supposed to do and went off script, but um, kind of threw the book out and went with her plan. The LSU softball team moves to 23-0 on the season after showcasing their offensive firepower early on in the game. The team will look to keep this going when they face Ole Miss in a three-game series right here in Tiger Park starting Saturday. Patricia Caputo for Tiger TV Sports.